About a year ago, I got Elgato's Facecam Pro webcam, but after using it for the last year, I've never been able to get it to work well. So when I saw reviews of the Insta360 Link 2 come out that were positive, I ordered one. I've been using it for about a month, and here's how it stacks up. The Link 2 has a bevy of new features. Here are a few of my favorites. It has a really impressive built-in microphone that pleasantly surprised me. It also can use AI to track faces and people around the room. One of my favorite features is desk view mode, where with the click of the button, the camera will pan down to your desk. It also allows you to lock out part of your environment so the tracking will not move the camera if you enter a certain area. It also has a built-in privacy mode. No matter how much I tweaked the settings or lighting conditions, I could never get what I thought was high quality video from the Facecam Pro. And with the Insta360 Link 2, its automatic settings produce pretty good video. I've got some video clips I generated at different light settings I'll show you now. All right, here's an example in my office. I only have one lamp on in the corner. This is looking directly at the Link 2 for both video and audio. Now I'll switch over to Facecam Pro, same exact scenario, uh, but I did switch over to the Yeti microphone as well. So you can see there's a pretty drastic difference in video quality at the low light level. All right, I've added in a couple of Elgato Key Light Airs. They're at 30%. I have one about 45 degrees off to my right, about 145 degrees off to my left. They're set at 3500 degrees Kelvin for the color temperature. Uh, and now we'll switch over to the Facecam Pro. And so you can see the difference. It does quite a bit better with more light, but there's a side-by-side -side comparison. Switch back to the Yeti mic as well. All right, I've got a high light source setting with a lot of natural light coming in from my right side from some windows. I don't have any other lights on. It's midday here. And right now I'm talking to you uh, by looking into the Link 2 camera with its audio. Now we'll switch over for comparison to the Fam Pro using the Yeti mic for audio as comparison as well. And you can see the difference. Let's talk about price. The Elgato Facecam Pro can be had for $299, while the Link 2 comes in at $199. And finally, the budget-friendly Link 2C for only $149. It's pretty much the same as the Link 2 minus the gimbal. Well, there you have it. I think the Insta360 Link 2 stacks up really well against the Elgato Facecam Pro. Surprisingly well. I'll probably actually end up selling my Facecam Pro and replacing it with the Link 2. If you'd like to find out more information on the Link 2, please check out the link below. Also, do you have comments about either one of these cameras? Please leave them in the comments section. A lot of people find those very useful, including myself. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you on the next video, and please do me a huge favor and like and subscribe.